Hey guys, uh, in this video I'm going to be showing you how I have been stretching my rings without an expensive ring stretcher and also how I've reduced the noise of doing this. Uh, my wife gets really annoyed because it's pretty loud when you just hit metal on metal. Uh, here is a before and after and I've already kind of bent these rings to the point where they're going to fit on this Rathburn ring stretcher here. I've got a notebook and then a bathroom mat underneath. This is my Rathburn ring stretcher and I'm going to go ahead and put the uh, smaller end of the ring facing down on this. And it barely fits on there so I actually have to squeeze it together to get it to go on. And then I want to make sure that it's pushed all the way down and it's on there nice and even. Looks pretty good. And then we'll uh, slip that stretching rod on there. And put it on the base, on the mat, on top of the notebook. I got some foam here. And then I've got like, it's like a fake leather little zip up pouch. Really any type of leather or fake leather. And then some foam underneath seems to work pretty well. Now the hammer is going to tear these up over time, but it drastically reduces the noise. Um, I had to take the sound off this video because my wife was having a conversation and it got picked up on this video. So I'm doing a voiceover right now. Uh, but I pounded it through until the stretching spike came out the bottom. And then I'm going to go ahead and knock that out with the hammer. And that will release the ring and the stretching rod. Now these Rathburn ring stretchers are pretty cool. Uh, you can get them for about $30. I've got a link for one in the description if you'd like to get one yourself. And I found them to be pretty useful. Now the main problem I have with them is just how noisy they are. So that's the main purpose of this video is to show you that you can reduce the noise if you are kind of clever about it. I'm gonna go ahead and stretch out one more ring for you guys to show you how this works. So we put it on top there, squish them all together, push it down, make sure it's nice and even. And it looks, looks even. And we'll slip that stretching rod in there and put it on the base, and then make it fall off the base. There we go. Yep, and then I'm going to put it back on, and bang on it. And this really does uh, reduce the noise, so if in, you're like in an apartment, or you're doing this while your significant other or family is sleeping, uh, this is a great way to get some work done without waking everybody up. And I try and make sure I can get that stretching rod decently through there to get that ring stretched as far as I can. And then I'll finish uh, the rings off in another step. Um, but this is definitely a way to stretch a ring, shape a ring, a coin ring without an expensive ring stretcher. Right. And you can do it rather quietly. I hope this video was helpful. Uh, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you'd like to see more coin ring making videos. Have a great day.